Stop recording. Hi. This is Bruce, the blind man handyman. And this is the 13 horsepower snowblower that we purchased. It has tracks. And it is amazing. And if you're leaving to go to Alberta or somewhere else to work and leaving your loved ones home during the winter and they're petite and small, you might have your wife or your older kids, this machine is great. It has lots of power, it's electric start, and reliable. Haven't had to change any shear pins yet. Things I do recommend to have is have a dozen shear pins on hand. Get two extra auger belts and one extra drive belt, just in case. If something happens, and it's usually it'll happen during a storm, at least if you got someone around that's handy, you can say, hey, I got the belts. So that's a, you know, but otherwise I can't see anything else going wrong with these machines. And, you know, I recommended the battery, battery maintainer to keep the batteries charged. And you'll have nothing but a blizzard in your driveway when you're blowing snow, but at least you'll have a clear driveway and uh, you'll be able to get in. So I, I hope you enjoy my video. And if you're going to purchase a snowblower, yes, this snowblower is very expensive but you're going to have the snowblower for 20 or 30 years and it's going to last it's a very well built super well built machine i haven't seen this machine built as well as this yet and i've seen some good machines out there so that's just my opinion if you want a great snowblower this is a great snowblower and i wish i could see to use it it looks like it'd be a lot of fun. So, there you go. So I hope you like my videos, and I just figured I'd give you some tips, because this is what I do. Fix things, and I analyzed everything to see what's the best, and what I'd like to use. Sometimes I sacrifice cheapness, because I'm not gonna use it very much. But Newfoundland, we have lots of snow, and I'm not the one blowing the snow. If it was me, I'd probably just have some piece of junk that I picked up on the side of the road and I'd be doing it. But it's not me doing it. Because I can't do it. So, I have to rely on someone else to do it. So I want to give them the easiest way I know how because I'm not sure who's going to be helping me. It could be a big person. It could be a small person. But this machine, anybody can handle it. From what I can see. As long as you're intelligent. And you take your time. So I walk with them, teach them how to use it, go slow first, and after you get the hang of it, then you'll have no problem. It's just big. <laughs> they make smaller ones, but they don't make smaller ones that can steer like this one. This is the only model I know of that can steer, so you don't have to shove it around. So, hope you like my video, and uh, have fun blowing snow. Okay? Stop 